Hi everyone, my name is Carmen and you're watching the New Leaf Podcast. I am trying a different setup at the moment. I'm just testing some things for the live stream coming up tomorrow and yes, I know the sound isn't optimal. My poor little laptop is working so hard and you can hear the noise very, very well and I've tried to set up a different microphone and it isn't working, so if you have any tips, please let me know. Um, but what I have done, so today in this little test video, I'm just uh, working on a little new cast on that was not planned whatsoever, but I'm also going to try out, see? I've connected my phone camera here as well and we can switch over ta-da I think this is so cool so and here you can see my little cast on can I zoom in actually oh I can that's amazing okay uh, so, yes, I'm still figuring out stuff, and this is all very new to me. But I'm just going to try it out and see how it goes. So I am... Oh my god, my laptop. <laughs> so I am going to be casting on a little crop top. It's called the My Secret Crop Top, I guess. I think, by Jessie Mae. And I'm, I'm doing the German Twisted Cast On which I do have a tutorial video for, but this is another good time to show you. So this is one of my all-time favorite cast-ons. It's perfect for ribbing, so whenever I knit socks from the cuff down, which is not often, uh, or whenever I start um, mittens or, you know, anything with ribbing, I, I like to do this. Oh, and hats, of course. I knit lots of hats. So what you do, you have your ball yarn here, and you have your yarn end here, and you kind of position your fingers as if you were doing the long tail cast on. But the long tail cast on is this, right? So you pick up the first bar and then take the third one through say one two three but that's not what we want to do so position your hands in the same way but then go all the way underneath strands one and two grab one no <laughs> I get so confused when I try to slowly do things. So go underneath strands one and two, dip back in there, and then you take strand number three and go through. Right? So go underneath strands one and two, dip back in there, and then when you come back up, you have a little triangle there. See? A very tiny triangle and that's where you want to take this thread through right so this is the German twisted cast on don't know if I said bind off earlier I don't know cast on obviously and I need to cast on 180 stitches so that is going to be a while I'm actually not sure. Oh, I see the camera is a bit laggy. It's because this camera, this camera is connected via Wi-Fi. Maybe that's something that I can solve <laughs> today. <laughs> yeah, this is all a very steep learning curve for me. So I appreciate any and all patience that you have while I sort this out. So, <laughs> so 
So yes, I thought that I would cast on something with this yarn, which is my own hand dyed yarn. This is dyed with Matter Root. Matter Root is one of my all time favorite dye materials. Um, creates a lovely coral red color. And I have lots of Matter Root dyed yarn in my shop right now um, that you could use to knit this crop top, well, and many other things. So it's a sport weight yarn, which means it is 300 meters per 100 grams. So it's in between a fingering, which is 400 meters per 100 grams. Fingering is also cut, uh, called uh, sock weight sometimes. So it's in between the fingering and DK. DK is double knit. It's 200 meters per 100 grams usually, or maybe 220 meters per 100 grams. And so double knit, it's, it's double the thickness of a fingering weight. And the sport weight is just in between there. And I like knitting it on three and a half millimeter but I mostly use a smaller needle size for everything because I knit very loose. So I'm sure most people would be able to knit this on four millimeter or maybe even four and a half or five. Um, it all kind of depends on the fabric you want to have. Uh, so yeah, lots of those skeins are in the shop right now. I will link it down below. Uh, go and grab some if you want them because I have a discount right now. 10% uh, off if you buy one and 20% off if you buy two or more. You do have to apply the discount codes, but they are in the shop listing as well. So in the uh, product description. Uh, it's 100% non-superwash merino, so yeah, it's totally buttery soft, amazing to knit with. I have a sweater in this, it's it's just really, really soft. Um, be aware though that the softer the fiber, the more it will pill, and yes, this fiber will also pill, uh, but you know, if you have a gleaner or some other kind of fabric brush then you know it's, it's not really a problem i think i might have <laughs> i think i might have run out of my yarn tail and these are no way that this is 180 stitches so i'm going to have to start over but i'm not going to make you watch all of that again so I am going to end this video here. Let me just return to the one camera. I love that. <laughs> um, yes, so thank you so much for watching this test video. Uh, I hope <laughs> that I'm able to improve things in the future. But, you know, if I'm not able to improve it before the live stream tomorrow morning, then this is just how it's going to be and i'm so grateful for any and all um understanding <laughs> so thank you so much and i hope to see you in another video bye bye